All right, Noah Fafita here from Servite High School. You've been in Tucson in college for a couple of weeks now. How do you feel? Do you miss your parents? Uh, not yet. Uh, <laughs> it, it's getting there, but I think the, the trip to Hawaii kind of clouded that a little bit. Um, I mean, my mom was here. I got here last Sunday, and my mom was here with me until last Thursday. And then we ended up going to Hawaii for a week. So this is kind of my first day without them. But I mean, I know it's going to get difficult. So I'm just trying to keep myself occupied. Hey, you're going to be so busy and have so much fun once you are submerged and everything here in the next couple of weeks. You won't even think about her. Sorry, mom. But I want to talk about mom for a little bit because she has been someone who's been so active on Twitter and social media, getting you here, getting you, your, some of your teammates here as well from Servite and from Orange County. What kind of prompted her to start doing all of that? Uh, I think... I mean, her her initial her initial reason, and even even when as we got going, it wasn't never for attention. It was that's not the type of person she is. So she kind of just did it as a joke, and she was trying to get T Mac to come, obviously. And then little by little, uh, Arizona fans started following her. She started getting more credit. But I mean, me and my dad laugh about it all the time because truth be told, she didn't get anybody. Like <laughs> she did nobody. I mean, I know Jacob Reese said he committed because of her, but at the end of the day, they they but we all bought into Coach Fish, so. Uh, she did her little her little gig on on Twitter on social media, but Coach Fish and Coach Doherty and the rest of the coaching staff get the real credit. Well, I think that she gets a little bit of credit, and it's fun to have her in there. I appreciate everything she's doing. It's nice to have that part of social media and be able to see your family members also be so excited for you and what's to come here in 2022. And I know you just touched on it a little bit, but what was the main reason that you wanted to come to the University of Arizona and be a part of this team? I think the the family atmosphere. I know it sounds cliche. Everybody says it, but um, I mean, ever since these guys got on campus, they hit me up. I was the first quarterback they they um, offered. Uh, and they told me that they wouldn't offer anybody else uh, if I committed, and they have it. They've held that true, so you don't you don't see that a lot of, a lot of times. And then just to add on, it's the NFL staff, um, and you can see you can see the direction this program is going in. So uh, we turned Servite Servite around uh, my freshman year, and uh, that's we're looking to do the same thing here. Okay, well, what are you looking forward to the most about spring ball and about getting into this team? I, I think getting on the field. Uh, I'm not a big weight room guy, uh, obviously. Uh, I, I'm interested in, in Coach T.O. He's a genius, so being able to work with him, trying to get bigger, stronger, faster is great, but uh, being on the field, that's what I'm here to do. All right, well, we can't wait to see you out there on the field. We've got an exciting signing day event, and then, of course, we're going to be able to see all of you guys in spring ball. It's open to the public, all of the practices in the spring game, and it'll be here before you know it, no, I promise. So enjoy every moment. Yes, ma'am. <laughs>